Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is January 28th of 2018. I I love metal. And I used to be, I'm going to, I used to be a welder for about 10 years. So I, I went to welding school, learned welding on different types of uh, metal. And uh, then later I was a member of the Boilermakers Union, the International Brotherhood of Boilermakers Blacksmiths. Blacksmiths. Uh, I'm not going to pretend, though, that I ever made a a knife. I never tried to make a knife. Did make hammers, chipping hammers, to uh, chip on the to use on the welding, but I never made a knife. But I sort of like to pretend that I did. Uh, one of my favorite episodes on the West Wing TV show is uh, Jed Bartlett, President Jed Bartlett, when he wants a knife. And I just love that episode. You may remember may remember that. This comes in a beautiful box, by the way. Oops, opening the wrong end of it. Here's the box that it comes in. And Oh, I was also gonna say I worked about thirty years uh, where I had to be armed every day. And I loved metal then with uh, stainless steel revolver and then later stainless steel auto. And I even had one uh, made out of, uh, I didn't have it made special for me, you know, nickel. And uh, so I'm a great fan of metal. But you know, I've never... I've never been a knife collector. Well, not even. I've owned different handguns, but I've never, uh, never really, haven't collected them, and never been a knife collector. And of course, I've always thought about, you know, I don't put things on the wall very often. Never have for some reason, but I've always thought about. You know, having a wall and having swords up on the up on the wall. Uh, this is a really great feeling knife, and it is really sharp, really sharp. <laughs> um, I'm not going to run my finger over there. It looks. Looks really, really great. This does not. This doesn't do. This does not do justice to it. You know the video. Uh, like I said, comes in a nice box. They have a card in there for you. They have uh, free VIP membership. Now these are cooking knives. Chef's knives. Although I wouldn't mind having having this thing on the wall just for decoration. Really great uh, little catalog book, and it talks about uh, the type of metal and uh, the handle, all that type of stuff. Some of that information you will find here on the Amazon site. By the way, uh, you can have German steel chef knife with wooden handle or you can have German steel chef knife let's see the what's the difference on that I don't know and this is the one that I have a German steel and it's a San Toku knife I'm, I'm sure I got that wrong but uh, German high carbon steel I'm not going to read all this to you but uh Rust corrosion, stain resistant. Uh, says it's seven inches. 
this mentions well they have a, they have all their knives listed in here and it says 7.5 I believe it is so I'm not sure if if I'm missing one of them uh, or not but it this book has their little catalog has all the information about them and I'm not sure if it's more well I think it is yeah maybe more than what you have on the uh, Amazon site here um, don't want to be repeating myself but uh, it is a hope I don't drop this up for myself I'd have to call 911 Hit the femoral artery, and nine one one wouldn't get <coughs> wouldn't get here early enough. Let's see. Also has I just noticed that from the on the butt of the handle. That's not a decal, that's I'm not sure what you call it etched in there or not a decal. Also I thought this thing on the side was a sticker, but it's not. Also the well let me show you on this. Oops. Go down here. That can you see that in the middle there? I was thinking that might be a sticker, but it's not. I'm going to put this away so I don't drop it. I'm, I'm getting to be old. Uh, hard sharpening edge, extra sharp, rust free. German steel. I haven't actually cut anything with it. I'm not I'm not going to for this review. I'm really I think this is like a work of art. I'm not going to hang it on the wall. But it's worthy to be on the wall, I'm sure. I think this may be the not much money for it, but I think it's probably the best knife that I've ever purchased. Well, for some reason, I don't, you know, I've got family members that have the finest cut, really, is it, or, you know, knives and stuff, and also pans and stuff, you know, they, and uh, I have paid good money uh, for the pans for, you know, for some reason, I have never ended up spending on a good knife and I've got a drawer full of pieces of I'm not sure if I can say crap in this review but knives that are and uh, I don't and I'm going to be 87 I think here in a few months I should have should have bought some good knives and had them in the you know well, we do have some good knives and forks and spoons, a set of those. Actually, my grandson, my grown grandson, he actually bought them. And uh, for this, uh, let me say, I'm giving this five stars, and I really recommend it to you. High carbon 
German steel. I feel like Jed Bartlett in the movie West or the TV show West Wing. If you watch West, if you watch the West Wing, you will remember that episode. If you decide to, I think it's on Netflix right now. If you uh, decide, if you watch it, the episode, you'll remember the episode. Anyway, I do recommend this uh, knife to you. Thank you very much for watching.